U.S. Attorney General ordered a shakeup at the federal prison in New York where suspected sex trafficker Jesse Epstein died. The investigation now proceeds into why guards apparently took their eyes off the notorious inmate. A law enforcement source with knowledge of the investigation tells CBS News that corrections officers may have falsified reports that they checked on Jeffrey Epstein as required by protocol. Epstein was taken off suicide watch about one week after trying to hang himself. The source tells CBS News his cellmate posted bail, leaving Epstein alone in his cell last Friday, the day before he died. Another source said it appears Epstein had been dead one to two hours before he was found. The Department of Justice says the warden of the federal jail will be reassigned and two prison staffers placed on administrative leave. One day after the FBI raided Epstein's 70-acre private estate in the Virgin Islands, the president said he wants a full investigation, which he said includes questions about former President Bill Clinton. So you have to ask, did Bill Clinton go to the island? That's the question. If you find that out, you're going to know a lot. On Saturday, President Trump retweeted a conspiracy theory that claims to link the Clintons to Epstein's death. A Clinton spokesman said the suggestion that the Clintons were involved is ridiculous and, of course, not true, and Donald Trump knows it. We will get to the bottom of what happened, and there will be accountability. As the investigation proceeds, we're also hearing firsthand what life was like for Epstein while he was in jail in Palm Beach County. Jeffrey Epstein was a high-profile inmate. And being that he was going to be housed in uh, T-Dorm, his cell is to remain unlocked. Sometimes he will come out, out of his cell, he will be naked. He would just be naked. Attorneys for some of the alleged victims say their clients feel robbed of justice. As I explained to them, the investigation is going to continue. It may be that others will be prosecuted if they help to recruit these children. I think... For all of the Epstein victims, it's going to take a long time to really get their minds around this. Well, a source tells CBS News the FBI also wants to review video cameras from the special housing unit where Epstein was held.